raise the corporate tax rate to 28 percent? Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Uh, what the president believes is one that uh, corporations can afford to pay a little bit more. Uh, and that's a way that can we can pay for a range of the bold proposals that he has put forward. Uh, but he also took a look at uh, these proposals uh, and the all of the tax proposals that he has put forward over time to find a way where there should be um, pay fors that, based on their based based on their bottom lines, uh, many of the Republican negotiators should be able to agree to. Lastly, Israel seems to be on the cusp of a new prime minister. What's at stake for the United States here? Does, does policy change as a result of this leadership change? Uh, we will leave, which won't be a surprise to you, Steve. Uh, the politics and the determination about uh, political formation in Israel up to the parties there. Uh, Israel will remain uh, an important strategic partner, uh, one where we have uh, a, in a, an abiding security relationship, uh, and that will continue. Go ahead. Thanks, I'll come Jim. back to you guys. Um, Go ahead. So just to clarify, is the president's position that he would be willing to do away with this increase in the corporate tax rate if Republicans agreed to a minimum 15 percent corporate tax rate? Well, let's take a step back. Okay. The minimum, the book minimum uh, was in the president's American Jobs Plan proposal as a proposed pay for. It was also in our budget. So this is not a new idea. This is a component of what he's proposed for a pay for that he's lifting up as a question as, as to whether they could agree to that, because it certainly doesn't violate anything about the 2017 taxes. Uh, so that's what he's putting forward as, as an idea that he's asking them uh, where their point of view is. So he's saying it could be one or the other. Well, no, he believes that we con should continue to look at raising the corporate rate. That is a way to pay for a range of ideas. He's got a lot of ideas out there, a lot of bold proposals, including that aren't a part of this infrastructure negotiation. And he continues to believe that corporations can pay more. But the bottom line is that these proposals he's put forward as pay for in the American Jobs Plan, including IRS enforcement, uh, which is also in our budget, of course, and this book minimum tax are ways that uh, unless you think corporations shouldn't pay any tax at all, and we'll leave that to, to uh, others to, to speak to, uh, then there should be a, a way to find a path to agreement. And how was that proposal received by Senator Capito? I'll leave her. I'll leave that to her and others okay. to speak to. Um, the President said yesterday.